we've said body sex is a big ask. So why is it such a big ask? And and what do women need to do to kind of get themselves to a workshop when they want to come? Well, body sex is a challenge. Yeah. And that's because it's shared vulnerability. Right. You know, Betty knew it had to be done in the nude because when we're in the nude and we're in a group and we don't have fashion and jewelry to separate us into a hierarchy, right? What's interesting is we see beauty in everyone and we see beauty in ourselves, but nudity is a hard thing to do. Some of us never see our families nude. Right. Right. And nudity, we sexualize it. It's not always sexual. In fact, in body sex, it really isn't sexual. Mm Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's much more sacred than that. So we have the nudity, then the group share. How do I feel about my body and orgasm? Right, right. And we're sharing vulnerability. We're sharing our story. We're sharing our experience. And it amazes me how quick, and I think it's because of the shared nudity, right? We're physically ready to be vulnerable. So then we're ready to be emotionally vulnerable. Yes. And then we do genital show and tell another ritual, right? Now it's my greatest intimacy. Mm -hmm. And then I have all of this appreciation and all this positive energy around me. I've been accepted as my most human, Mm -hmm. right? Because that's our humanity. Right, right, right. When we share our vulva and then the crescendo erotic recess, Mm -hmm. you know, and then we share sex energy and, you know, the vulnerability. And when we share that, it creates interpersonal connection. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Exactly. And then it deepens our connection to self and our appreciation of self. I'm I'm thinking back to our May retreat. Ah, what a fantastic group of women and, and the space that it created. And the thing is, it's not through like the, the, the safe container, which is the, the term used nowadays is created by the leaders going first, right? We go first. We're not asking you to do anything that we're not doing ourselves. So it's not about a bunch of rules that, you know, are supposed to be put in place to make us feel safe. Um, It's it's really the space. It's the leaders. It's the respect uh, that we show each other that's modeled. Well, we go first, we bow our head, we're mm-hmm. nude too, we share our orgasm too. Right. And that's it. It's the circle. It's a yes. galaxian. And I love when I can witness the women supporting each other. Right. So it's not just the support and the energy that you get from us. Right. The support that you get from the other women. And there was this moment in the circle where a woman had this kind of out of body experience where she felt disconnected from her body mm-hmm. because her body has been changing. And she called me over Mm -hmm. and she said, Carl, and I'm just feeling disconnected. And she told me why. And I said, you're sharing your body, you know, and I, and as I'm speaking to her, the woman next to her said, oh, that happened to me. Yes. And then they were bonded and this little kind of group came together and we were all supporting her and we let her know it takes a year and then you're going to feel better. And, you know, everyone's giving their own personal story, not advice. Right. But it's my share of how I handled it. And you see the smile go across her mm-hmm. face. Yeah. Right? So here she's been ministered to by people she just met two days before. And that connection and that bond, mm-hmm. you know, they all go to WhatsApp and they start a group, but that's forever. Right. Right. Exactly. Exactly. And I think that's the power of the circle. Because it's not just you as a leader and me as an assistant. It's really, it's all of the women together nurturing each other. I am always blown away by how women support other women in that context. I don't believe women are competitive by Mm -hmm. nature. I think it's conditioning because it's not what I've witnessed. If you put a group of women together Mm -hmm. and they feel safe and seen and supported, it's nothing but love and joy. Right. And that's why you get a little hit of that and you just want to stay there forever. So we're running another circle in October, October 14th through 17th. The link is right here. Or the link will be in the bio. It's bodysex.com slash workshop hyphen retreat. 
So if you want to experience sisterhood, you can come and join us. And we're offering an early bird discount right now. If you register and pay in full by July 1st, you'll save 10%. 